Indiana State Police are investigating a semi-crash. DeKalb County Sheriff's apprehend a man after a chase. And Waterloo celebrates the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. I'm Maggie Johnson. These stories and more next on Hoosier Ohio News Channel. Froggy 106.7 is all about variety. From pop to rock and even a little country. Mix it all up in a way to help you get through your workday. You've got the most variety on your radio. Froggy 106.7. Who's your Ohio News Channel? Leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local, dependable, on demand. And now, the latest from Who's your Ohio News Channel. Troopers from the Indiana State Police Toll Road Post are investigating a personal injury crash involving two semi-tractor trailers that occurred in the westbound lanes at the 128 mile marker on Wednesday evening. According to Trooper Andrew Mills, at approximately 5.05 p.m., a 2007 Freightliner semi-tractor operated by a 61-year-old man from Mansfield, Ohio, was traveling eastbound on the toll road. For an unknown reason, he drove through the median and struck a westbound semi-tractor trailer oper operated by a 43-year-old Wheaton, Illinois man head-on. As a result of the crash, the Illinois man was trapped in his cab but was eventually extricated and flown by Western Michigan Med Flight to Parkview Hospital in Fort Wayne. His condition is unknown at this time. A Hicksville man led police in Ohio and Indiana on a wild chase Wednesday afternoon. Brian Laney, who is currently wanted for several warrants in Indiana and Michigan, got in his car and fled when Defiance County Sheriff's visited a home in Hicksville to interview with a suspect and found Laney to have multiple warrants. Police chased Laney until he eventually wrecked on County Road 64 in DeKalb County. Laney then tried to run on foot but was eventually apprehended by the DeKalb County Sheriff's Department. No officers were seriously injured in the incident and Laney is currently being held on drug-related charges out of Steuben County and also faces charges in the state of Michigan. And Saturday, a parade celebrating the 100th anniversary of the Indianapolis Motor Speedway will take place in Waterloo. The parade will start at 10.30 a.m. and an art show will take place in the train depot following the parade until 5 p.m. And that's the news for now. If you see news happening, let us know about it. Email us, who's your news at gmail.com. I'm Maggie Johnson. Have a terrific day.